Hi, I'm Margie Zatz. I had the privilege of being a founder of Groves, and I'm so happy to be with you today. It was a day bursting with sunlight, a September morn bright with expectations that something wonderful was going to happen. The crisp autumn air was filled with anxious chatter. Something special was about to happen, and it would change the lives of many among us. We, the committee, stood together along with a crowd of educators and parents and their kids, all of us so eager to take that first step forward to cross the threshold and enter the premier school in Minnesota created exclusively for children with learning disabilities. Fly back with me more than 50 years ago to a departure gate at Northwest Airlines. Four mothers, four fathers gathered together to say goodbye to their children. No, it was not the parents who were leaving. It was the kids, some as young as 10, who were flying to boarding school in Florida. At the time, the only faculty available for those who had a learning disability. One final hug, a promise they'd come home for Christmas, and a hidden tear or two. We love those children enough to let go to let them fly halfway across the country in hopes they would learn to read and write. All this was the catalyst of Groves. We talked together and formed a committee determined to create a school in the area. We hired a teaching staff from the East Coast as there weren't any trained instructors locally. Those pioneers from Connecticut took a chance on us as did the 35 students who walked through that door so long ago. Today, the magnificent teaching staff and expert leadership contribute their talents each day. Their wisdom is a reservoir from which your children gain strength and develop the potential you knew they always had. In turn, they become the inspiration for all the children we have yet to meet. Their success also gives comfort to the many parents who are searching for answers. You have inherited a remarkable history, one built on the kindness to others. I thank you for being the people you are as I leave Groves most fondly in your capable hands. Thank you. <laughs>